Welcome to the weekly market update from Signature Wealth Management. I'm Brian Ransom, Research Director from Signature Wealth, and here's what happened in the market this week. The market has bounced around quite a bit these last two weeks. On May 10th, the market started a three-day, 4% decline, followed by a fairly strong recovery. Then on Wednesday, May 19th, the market experienced a sharp 1.5% decline on the opening bell, followed by a second strong recovery. Should the market enter a prolonged pullback period, it would not be unprecedented, unexpected, or even unhealthy. During the recovery following the 2008 global financial crisis, the market experienced 286 days of a strong recovery before pulling back 15% for 90 days and then resuming the subsequent bull market run for the next decade. Currently, we are at day 287 in the recovery following the pandemic not be unusual to experience a pullback or a period of consolidation for the next few months. Crypto market also experienced a bit of volatility this week. Ethereum, the second most popular cryptocurrency besides Bitcoin, peaked on the 12th before falling 36% over the next eight days, including a $1,000 drop on a single day on the 19th. Prices recovered fairly rapidly, but this asset class remains very volatile. There is reason for optimism, however. As mentioned in previous videos, one of my favorite indexes to follow for overall market health is the semiconductor index shown in red here. Semiconductors have struggled relative to the broader market for about a month now, signaling weakness in the overall market. But after the sudden drop on the 19th and the subsequent rally, semiconductors surged ahead 6.8% compared to the market's 2.5%, indicating that there could be positive signs ahead. For more information on this topic or a variety of other topics, including market updates, financial planning, and wealth management, please visit our corporate LinkedIn page, and we'll see you next week.